with three world championship titles across three disciplines, multiple wins in Las Vegas and uncountable world records, you can argue that Mike Slusser is the best compound archer to ever walk this planet. But why does Mike decide to have so much weight on his bow? The current world number one has nearly 60 ounces of weight on his bow, of which 31 are on his front rod. Is this how Mike Slusser became Mr. Perfect? We find out on this episode of Why Do They Do That. Why do you have so much weight on your bow in the first place? Um, we kind of started off with a, a joke. Uh, we were back then at the training center. And back then, Rio was shooting a lot of weight. It was like in 2012, 2013. And we started kind of as a joke, like, you cannot handle it. And it was like, every, like I grabbed every single weight I had and put it on my bow. And I shot it for like a day. And after the day, I was like, this, this could work. Like, I feel really comfortable with that. So I trained a bunch with it and later on uh, like I started shooting with it and from there on we started. I started with uh, 22 ounces up front. Back then with the, the fuse, uh, the blades, yeah. was the maximum we could put on on the blades because of the screw. And uh, then I went to the axe taper and the weights were really small so I needed to go more on it. And then eventually I ended up what I'm doing now, it's like 32 up front and 18 on the back. Yeah. Which leads me to my second question. Yeah. Why do you have so much weight up front compared to the weight in the back? If you compare it to other archers uh, mm -hmm. in the compound area, they tend to kind of balance uh -huh. a bit, but you have a very front heavy bow. Um, I have a lot of pressure in my bottom of my front hand. Yeah. So when I'm aiming, I have a lot of pressure in the bottom of the hand. So I always tend to like push it up. And that's why I came up with more front weight than normally. And uh, for me, it just aims better, especially because back then when I was at the training center, it was always windy. So I think like when I shot, with the heavy front weight, it helped me a lot in the wind. Yeah. Um, do you think um, the heavy weight made you into the world number one? Or would you have made world number one without the heavy weight as well? I think it definitely helps, especially when I'm uh, nervous or when it's windy, because like a lot of World Cups is always windy. Yeah. And I really think that it's helping me, especially in, uh, in those conditions. 